I've been asked to take a look at this Nintendo Switch. Apparently, one day it just stopped charging and doesn't dock. Let's have a look at the pins under the microscope before we plug it in. I don't want to cause any more damage to it. Okay, there's one side, and the pins look to be there. I mean, sure, they look pretty dirty. It's quite gross inside there, but nothing appears to be bent out of place. And there's the other side. Same, really. So I don't think we do any damage by plugging it in to see what it does, but I am going to clean it first. I'm just going to use some isopropyl alcohol to clean it with, and a flux brush. And let's get right in there. Right, clean. Let's see what it looks like under the microscope now. Yep, definitely a bit cleaner. Let's plug it in now and let's see what it's doing. Right, let's plug the USB amp meter thing in. And genuine USB charging cable. Our survey said. Oh, it's very, very loose. Okay. Let's try it the other way around. Yeah, it's just super loose. It's not, it's not doing anything. Right, I think it's going to need a new port, kids. I mean, there could be more wrong with it than that, but let's start by assuming it needs a new port. Ooh, micro SD card. Nice. Most of these screws are a Y00, I believe. Uh, well, it works anyway. Apart from these, I think, on the edge here, which are just standard Phillips. And uh, voiceover Steve, will you do me a favour? Can you try and read out the Holy Hand Grenade patrons, but... Do it in the style of someone who does an advert and has to read the terms and conditions very quickly. Thanks. Patreon shout out to Valley for Holy Hang Grenade Two Only. This currently applies to Tidder, Ellis Garber, Jamrag Billion, Oz Newton, Wine Junkie, Mark Viz 19, Weston himself, Roddy Morley, L. Taylor, Jonathan Harden, Def William, Flim, Jonathan Williams, McAdams, Drew Picard, Pipe Chess, Alex Reason, Mon Base, Albert Mark, Flux, and the Dwega, and Motem and Monkey Joe, Tokyo, Quinkled, Kuzaro, Fruka, Fisher, Fiat, and Neil Rail. Certain restrictions may apply. See Patreon website for details. I'll tell you what, there are plenty of screws missing out of this. I'm guessing it's been apart before. Or it's just been dropped numerous times. That thermal paste is rock hard. That'll need the incorrect amount putting back on. Where are my ceramic tweezers? Right, let's disconnect the battery before we do anything. Okay. These Joy-Con rails are very loose as well. Oh, wow. That's actually moving on the board. Let me get this under the microscope and show you. Right, so there's the USB port. Check this out. <laughs> oh, no. There's damaged traces there, isn't there? Those two are moving independently of the rest. Oh dear. Right. Let's take these screws out. I'm guessing this is just going to fall out. Which it's obviously not supposed to do. The screws are also very loose. What do we think? Is it just going to fall out? Yep. Wow. There it is. Right, so we've got two pads still attached to it. We've got five legs still attached to the board, but that's easy enough to get rid of. And those, do they actually go anywhere? I'm not sure they do. I might get away with that, you know. Yeah, even the mounting points here are broken. I'm guessing this has been dropped with the charger in it or something, and it's, you know, bent it out and snapped it. Don't know, though. I'm going to take the circuit board out, because obviously I can't put a new one in inside the plastic because it will melt. So we'll do that and then we'll get back to this. You don't want to see me doing that, it's quite boring. So let's just do a jump cut or something. Expert jump cut there. It's out. Let's get it under the microscope. Holy moly. Right, well let's give it a clean and let's see if we can work out how bad this damage is. Pretty bad. Right, this one I don't think goes anywhere, but this one goes to this little via, or via, here, or higher, no, here, just here. So I don't know whether I can just scrape a little bit of that away, I don't know whether I get away with that, it's awfully, awfully small. I obviously need to get these off as well. I'm going to try and get them off now actually, so that I don't risk damaging any pads. This gives me another opportunity to use a gift. A six-arm soldering station with USB fan. Nice. And this is a gift from Stuart Martin. Love the videos. Interesting, funny, great singing. What more could you want? Keep up the good work. Looking forward to what's next. Cheers, Stuart M. Thank you very much, Stuart. Much appreciated.
Glad someone appreciates my singing. Let's fully clean up this area. Let's add some flux. And I'm going to add some leaded solder because the solder that's on the board will be unleaded. Well, it already looks better, doesn't it? And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the new port on and then I'm going to try and fix that damage pad. So I also need to get these little snapped legs out. Same thing, better flux, better leaded. There we go. Use a bit of solder wick to try and wick up this excess. Nice. Right, let's offer up the replacement port. Oh, that's, that fits nice. I think this is where the helping hands thing comes in very useful because you can obviously do this and heat this board from underneath. Right, I've got no idea how that went. It's really difficult when you can't see things under a microscope, but I figured that was worth a try. If it if I can't do it, then I'll just go back to the microscope. Right, they're all they're all solid. Yeah. Okay. So I'm hoping the ones underneath are as well. Let's just try and do a little bit of trace repair on this. Let me just clean it up a bit. It was this one, wasn't it? And there she is. Alright, how am I going to do that? I wonder if just a blob of solder is going to work on that. Let's try it. Don't need that much flux. I think this calls for the micro soldering pencil. Much smaller. Oh, I think that is going to need a little tiny jumper wire. Right, I'm going to need the world's smallest jumper wire. 0.1 millimeter wire. I'm going to try and use that. And I've cut off the tiniest amount, but of course it looks massive on here. And let's see if we can get that connected between those two points there. Wow. Is that on? Yes, I do believe it is. Let's clean that up and inspect it. Yep. That looks pretty good to me. Oh, let's solder the anchor points on the back and then I'll test it. I can't be bothered to change the tip, so I'm just going to try it with this little micro one. It might not work. I might have to change tips. It works. I don't think I'm going to connect everything up. I'm not sure how much I actually have to connect up. I can't remember. But I'll put in as much as I think is necessary and then we'll see what it's doing. Alright, there we go. Oh, let's plug in the charger. 0 0.31, 0 0.46. Let's see if we got anything on the screen. Yes, boy! Ultimate test though. Let's try it the other way around. Come on! Right, so this battery is completely flat. I'm going to leave it charging for a bit. I obviously need to install the incorrect amount of thermal paste. And then I need to put it fully back together. And we need to check to see whether it docks. Because I'm impatient, I'm going to try and turn it on. Yes! Come on! Get in there! Oh, that was short-lived. I think I need to retract that. Get in there. Is that because it's not got enough power? Stop being so impatient, Steve.
Oh, why's it gone off? Haha, -ha, because it's turned on. Get in. Right, well, let's power it off fully and let's put it back together and then we'll test. How do you power it off? I've forgotten. And now it's time for the incorrect amount of thermal paste. Yes, I know. We also need to put some here. Oh, yes. Et voila. I really hope this docks now after doing all this. I'd be very upset if it doesn't. Might even swear. There we go. Fully back together. Let's see if it docks. Actually, before we do that, let's make sure it still actual works. Yes. Excellent. Yes, come on! Oh, I've not got any controllers. Nice. Yeah. Right, oh. Right, there only appears to be Fortnite. <laughs> There's on here. Hmm. Well, I'm not playing Fortnite, so I'm going to go and get another game. Nice. Right, Mario Kart, that's better. Oh my <laughs> Why am I so rubbish at this game? Oh. Yes, that's right. It's a stupid game. I hear what you're saying, it's a stupid game you're playing play that game. You can't play that, game. play that game It's a stupid game, play that game. Ooh.